Hey guys, it's your girl Mariela and today's video is going to be a tutorial. This was requested by one of my subscribers, PinkyBird1480. She actually liked the way I did my hair on my latest outfit of the night for City Night Out. Yeah. And she actually has sent me a message and she said, you know, how do you do your hair? Like, I really like the way you did it. So if you guys want to see how I came out with this hair look, please stay tuned. Okay, so first what I do is blow dry my hair first. I do use my Tresemme Heat Tamer, which is great. You can use any volumizing styling. Most This was my Wella Natural Volume. And before that, just to detangle my hair, I did use my Got To Be Smooth Operator Leave-In Conditioner. As soon as I put all the products, I applied it all over my hair. I make sure I do comb just to distribute all the products on my hair. Then what I do is that I do flip my hair and then I use this crazy big brush and I start like blow drying it with my Remington blow dryer. And then I just start, well, I don't know how I can show you, but like, I pretty much blow dry it this way. And it does give me obviously a lot of volume, but because if it's a night out that I go out, whatever, I just want to make sure that my hair is going to stay throughout the whole night. I do use my strainer. Now, I don't strain my whole hair because it's pretty much almost straight. The one thing that I'm a little bit like anal and picky about is probably the ends. And then after that, I grab this part of my crown right here because I really want the focus there to be va 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 boom. And I part it in half. And using one of these medium sized bulk rows, which you can find them in any drugstore or any beauty supply store, there you go. Roll it inwards. Use any clips, I'm gonna use these. Whatever it's left, and there you go. Now I look like crazy Snooky. <laughs> I do leave them for like 10 or 15 minutes. Obviously, the longer it stays, the more volume. I do like to tease my hair. Now, I know teasing your hair, it's a bad, big no-no because you're damaging your hair. I know. But I don't do this look every single day. I only do it on special occasions when I want to go out. Now, I feel like being sexy <laughs> and make sure my hair is on point. Using a teasing brush, and this one is by Goody Pro. What I do is I like the volume to be here because... I have baby hair, baby fine hair. I do like to first use Tresemme hairspray. I first spray it and then I start teasing. There you go. I do the rest and tease it. What a difference. Flat, boo, ooh, looking like a tiger or like a lion actually. <laughs> and if you want, you can do the same thing or obviously in the back on the crown, which I am, because I'm gonna take it there. Spray it, <clears throat> losing my voice. Tease it. And just finish here. Spray it, tease it, spray it, and tease it. Now I look so crazy right now, I can just go out and look very sexy. Now. <laughs> With the same teasing brush, I'm gonna comb it. I don't wanna also kill the poofiness and the volume that I got going on right now. And it starts being part of my hair. So in the meantime, you can do whatever it is that you need to do in the house. I mean, I'm not expecting you to leave the house like this. <laughs> you can read a magazine, catch up on stuff, whatever. 15 minutes passed away. Start removing the clips and the Velcro. Even though I used the Velcro, 
I will use my spray and do the same thing that I did around my hair. Voila. Then I'm gonna comb it just to even everything out and it looks nice and neat. And now with this, because I want the ends to be nice, go back with your straightener and flip it out. Now, the way I had it on my video, I did part it in half. So I'm gonna use this side of my teasing brush and start spraying so it does stay on. And then spray the other side. If you wanna make sure that you give it a little bit more shine, and also if you have fried your ends like you know they're really damaged i do use my argan oil and this is the one and only argan oil oil treatment i dab a teeny little bit i do rub it on my hands and i focus obviously at the ends because if i do it on the root forget it then my hair is gonna be like flat again and this is the final look i mean i know you can't really really tell but I'm gonna show you how my hair looks on the side. I hope you guys liked this video. I've never done any hair tutorial, but it was requested by one of my subscribers. I hope it was helpful, girl. And I'll see you in the next video. Besitos. Bye.